your card. No, good afternoon, sir. I do have a change of plea form in my file. Are uh, the initials in the signature on this form are they yours? Yes, Your Honor. Did you read and understand the contents of the form? Yes, Your Honor. Any questions about the form? No. You understand by pleading guilty that you'll be uh, waiving certain constitutional rights, including the right to a speedy and public trial by jury, the right to confront and cross examine the witnesses against you, the right to remain silent, and the right to present evidence on your behalf. By pleading guilty, do you understand that you're giving up these rights? Yes, sir. All right, um, uh, my understanding then is the agreement with the people that you'll be entering a plea of guilty to count 12, the violation of Government Code Section 89503A. And that you will be stipulating as a factual basis to the grand jury transcript. Is that your understanding? Yes, Your Honor. All right, then as to count false, sir, then how do you plead guilty or not guilty? Yes. All right, guilty plea will be entered then. The court will dismiss the balance. All right, I understand that you wish to resolve this matter today. Is that correct? That's correct. Yes, Your Honor. All right, again, I do have a change of plea form in the file. Are the initials and the signature on the form are the yours? Yes, Your Honor. Did you read and understand the contents of the form? Yes, Your Honor. Any questions about this form? No, Your Honor. Before reading and signing this form, did you thoroughly discuss with your attorney all your options for today? Yes, Your Honor. All right. So you understand by pleading guilty, you're going to be giving up certain constitutional rights, including the right to speedy and public trial by jury, the right to confront, cross-examine the witnesses against you, the right to remain silent, and the right to present evidence on your behalf. By pleading guilty, do you understand that you're giving up these rights? Yes, Your Honor. All right, as to count then, my understanding is count 55 of violation of government code section 89503A. That's the, that's the count that which will be pleaded guilty to. And the stipulation is to the grand jury transcript as a factual basis then, is that correct? That's correct. All right, so Ms. Lopez then as to count 55, again, a violation of government code section 89503A, and that is the misdemeanors to that count now, how do you plead guilty or not guilty? Guilty. And then are you also, do you agree you are stipulating to the grand jury transcript as a factual basis for that plea? Yes, Your Honor. All right, the court will accept the plea. I find that the court is guilty. I will sign the change of plea form. And people's motion, dismiss the balance. Well, I would say so. Okay. And that will be granted. 